Hi, I'm Rachel Friedman of A Better Pet, and I am going to be using the next few minutes to introduce clicker training to a puppy who I met uh, about six hours ago with no known background, no training, probably about four months of age, appears healthy, um, doesn't have any formal training. And we're introducing clicker training, uh, bearing in mind the six pillars of the distractions, distance, duration, structure, management, and training. Introducing the clicker, this little noise-making box, which makes that noise. And I'm going to be using as treats um, dog food. It's not too high value to overstimulate the dog, who's underweight and probably would eat anything, very food-motivated. Um, but we're going to use the treats, um, the dog food as his treats. So, um, and I'm going to get my dogs who are interested in having treats as well. Uh, get out of the way um, from their training to not interfere with this little fellow um, right here who I'm calling Bosco. So uh, this is trip under here, is just walked away. So what I'm going to do first is um, just introduce him to the clicker. So for making eye contact, I click and give him a piece of food. He makes eye contact. I click, I give him a piece of food. He makes eye contact. I click. I give him a piece of food. That was bad timing. I actually clicked him for looking away. I didn't mean to. Click for eye contact. Good boy. And he's already sitting, which I didn't ask him to do. He just offered that as a sort of default behavior. Maybe he's been given treats in a sit position before. Um, and I'm going to now encourage him away from the place where he's sitting so that he can come back and be re rewarded for sit uh, with the distraction of Trip whining in his ear because he wants to have treats too. So I click on treat and I toss the treat for him, although Trip's stealing it. So, and here comes Bean, the food motivated dog. Um, this is really putting him through the challenge because usually you want to introduce clicker training um, when there's not a lot of distractions, but. Why not just throw it all at once? Hi. So he did come back, and I did click and treat him while I was talking to the camera, uh, since I could see him um, through the camera, uh, for sitting. So I'm going to just sort of give him a moment to think, despite the distractions of dogs and not a cat. Hi. Hi. Eh. So he puts his paw on me. I said, eh. He takes his paw off. I click and treat for taking his paw off.